How to create a construction business website for beginners. Hi, my name is Adela Passos and I'm your course instructor for today. I'm a business coach and consultant, author of five best-selling business books. I've helped over 700 people start their own business. And today I have over 10,000 online students. You probably recognize my face from my show called What's Your Game Plan? Today we have almost 18,000 subscribers on the channel. And I've been featured on some of your favorite websites for teaching business and entrepreneurship. Now let's get into the important stuff. There's several ways to create a website. The way that I'm going to show you today is the fastest and most cost effective way. So make sure you're following each and every single step. And please leave me a comment and feedback at the end of the course. Step one, get a website domain name and WordPress hosting plan. So you want to go to Bluehost website and buy a WordPress hosting plan, which costs about $120. So once you land on their homepage, they're going to show you all of their different package pricing for the websites. You can compare all of the different plans and see what they all have to offer. They have plans for blogs and personal websites, business websites, and if you needed to start an online store. For me, I will just click the plan for $2.95. The next page that it's going to take you to is where you decide on what your website name is going to be. Type in what you'd like to have and see if it's available. If the domain name is available, go ahead and fill out all the required information to set up your account and then scroll down to take a look at the package information. You're gonna get the best deal by doing at least a 12 months package or more. There's also package extras that allow your domain name to have privacy and be protected. Um, there's also information about securing your website from malware and hackers. And then you can also opt in for getting an email address that matches your domain name. So I'm going to go ahead and select my options and it will calculate a total and then after that just put in your payment information and buy your WordPress hosting. Step two, shop for a WordPress website template. Okay, so we're going to go to the website called Envato and type in construction WordPress in the search bar. After that, it's going to display a whole list, probably five or six pages of WordPress templates for construction website. You can see that the templates range in price. Some of them are $25, $35, but a lot of them go up to about 80 or 90. The ones that are 80 or $90 usually have a lot of support options as well as demo options for you to choose from. Take your time, browse through all the different layouts that they have available and then proceed to checking out the demos. When you click on the link for the template, it's going to show you exactly how many people have purchased this item, what the reviews look like for this template, the cost. Um, they'll even go over some of the features and give you video tutorials, show you the documentation, show you the different ways that you can customize this specific template. What you want to do is click the live preview and then that's going to take you over to an area where you can view all the demos and choose a template. Next, what you're going to see is a page that shows you all the possibilities that you can have with this template. These are called demos. So you're going to view all the different layouts and pick which demo is the best one for you. Which one do you like the most? Because that's the exact template that the website designer is going to set up on your hosting plan. This is another really nice template that I liked. Um, I think the design and the style looks really good. If you're happy with these colors for your brand, you can just choose this one and it looks just like this out of the box. If you don't want to do this, you can pay your web designer to customize the colors and all of that could be done for a very reasonable price and can be done very quickly. Step three, download template and upload to drive. So once you purchase your template from Envato, it'll send you to a download portal. And what you're going to want to do is just hit download all files and documentation. And what that's going to do is download a zip file that now has your WordPress template inside of it. 
Go ahead and create a new folder on your Google Drive and you can name it whatever you'd like. I'm just naming mine WordPress template. Once that's all ready, go ahead and upload that zip file to that new folder. Okay, so once that file has completely uploaded, right click on the file name to update the access. You're gonna wanna change the general access from restricted to anyone with a link. After you click anyone with a link, go ahead and copy that link by clicking the button on the left and then hit submit. Now you're gonna to prepare to send that link to a web designer. Step four, find a website designer and get pricing. So now we're gonna head over to the website called Fiverr and type in WordPress demo in the search bar. And what it will reveal are tons of people who are willing to help you get this website set up from $10 to about $120. All the services that they offer are going to range. You're gonna to need to do your research and see who exactly can help you set the demo up and customize it if you need it. If you're a WordPress expert like me, I don't actually need anyone to help me customize the WordPress website, but they can do it for you for an additional fee. Most WordPress website demos could be installed within a couple hours. So that means that you could have a fully functional website ready in less than a day. If you like what this seller has to offer, you can go ahead and purchase one of their basic standard or premium plans or if you feel like you need something special you can actually go ahead and click the button over to the right hand side that says contact seller and then you can click get a quote this is going to prompt a little form where you can fill out information about who you bought your website hosting with which template did you get which demo do you like which one do you want installed and if you need it customized and then you can also tell them how quickly you'd like it delivered step five prepare website content before they actually create your website you're going to need to put in some work you need to create all of the content for these pages on your website let's take a look at the template so let's say for example this is your new website you're going to need all the text the pictures the videos the information the social media links all of that information to fill out and populate your new website the best thing to do is to prepare all of this and put it into a word document label which part of the website it belongs to and then you're going to give that information to the website designer so they can complete the customization process step six order the website so now you have all of your content done and you've chosen a designer to work with they send you a little bill for what you've place an order for once you pay for it you're able to communicate with them about the details of the website you can send logos back and forth you can message with them until they actually complete and deliver your new website step seven test the website and change your passwords so once they hand over the website to you the WordPress administrative backend looks like this what you're gonna do is log into your new website backend on the left hand side of the screen you're going to click users and what you'll see is that they've set up a user account so that they can log in and out of your website to make changes so here you can do two things you can log them out and you can just change the password for the admin or you can just add a new user and create your own name and make yourself an admin on your account congratulations you now have a new website thank you so much for watching and if this course was helpful to you please make sure you like it share it and tag your friends and until next time guys take care